ever wondered how living things around you changed or developed over time? Like someone in your family, your grandparents, your parents, your siblings. They changed and developed over time. This is because of their life cycles. Hi friends, welcome back. Today we will learn about life cycles and some interesting facts about life cycles at the end of the video, so don't forget to watch till the end. A life cycle is a series of stages a living organism goes through during its lifetime. A life cycle shows how living things grow and change over time. The life cycle of an organism in a life cycle ends when the organism dies, but the life cycle still continues with the reproduction. Reproduction is the key to the continuation of all living organisms' life cycles. Some lifespans are short, whereas some take a longer lifespan. Just like mayfa, mayflies, it lives only for 24 hours. Whereas a Greenland shark lives up to an average of 272 years to 512 years. All life cycles start with four basic stages, which start from a seed, egg, or live birth. Then they grow up and reproduce during their adulthood, and the life cycle repeats again and again. Some babies are born or hatch from eggs, like chickens and birds. Some look much like their parents, like kittens and horses. Whereas, other baby animals look much different from their parents, like tadpoles, which will turn into frogs. Let's look at some different types of life cycles. A human life cycle. A human life cycle begins with the fetus in the mother's womb. The baby is then born, it grows, and reaches its childhood stage. Gradually, it changes into an adolescent and then it develops and becomes more mature and is an adult. The adults look for a mate to begin the life cycle all over again with new babies. Each type of animal has their own unique life cycle. A butterfly life cycle. A butterfly life cycle lays eggs that hatch into baby caterpillars. As the caterpillar eats, it grows bigger. Then it moves to its next stage, transforming into a chrysalis. And eventually, it is ready to transform into a butterfly and lays eggs to continue their life cycles. A plant life cycle. Life cycle starts as a seed. And when the seed sprouts, we call that germination. Then it starts growing and becomes an adult plant. When the plant is mature, it produces flowers. Flowers are fertilized, sometimes by animals like honeybees or sometimes by the wind. After a flower is fertilized, most plants make seed in the form of fruit. The seed inside the fruit can be planted and be grown into a new plant and the cycle starts all over again. A bird life cycle. Bird life cycles start when a female bird lays eggs. When the offsprings emerge from the eggs, they become hatchlings. After the hatchling develops, it becomes a chick. Chicks are similar to its parents. They are fed by their parents slowly. Their wings are developed and they fly like their parents. They find food for themselves and become a fully grown bird and lay eggs to continue the life cycle. Fun facts of life cycles. The time period of an organism spends at each stage can be different for each organism. The time an African elephant takes for the baby to grow in the womb before it is born is 22 months 
the longest of any mammal. A group of cicadas that emerge from the soil every 17 years to molt and mate but die approximately 5 to 6 weeks later. Did you know that the seahorse has an amazing life cycle where the male seahorse gives birth to infant seahorses? This is because the female seahorse fills the male broad pouch with eggs so the baby seahorses grow in the male broad pouch. Isn't it not interesting? So this is all about life cycles. Thank you for watching. Hope you liked this video and bye. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share.